Hey YouTube, it's Jewel with My Time to Shine and I wanted to show you my spring decorations that I've thrown up. I have my staple pictures as always. I did throw up a new piece of milk glass there. It's not new, but I mean it's not usually in the living room. That's usually in the living room, my little gather sign. And then I use this milk glass and some of this um, stuffing stuff for packages and put a couple of eggs on there. And then we believe in the Easter Bunny here. And another milk glass with some of the shavings and a couple of eggs. Just a milk glass vase with some sticks in it. Old time David and Jewel, 28 years ago. <laughs> um, a vase and then grandma and grandpa on their wedding day. And by the way, this was David and his mom on their wedding day. But we had, um, actually that's their graduation pictures, I lied. If you want to come on down this way, have our I Love Us sign. This new sign I got, it's a little bunny smelling. He's so cute. He looks like he's smelling maybe a butterfly. I'm not sure. Um, the I Love You More sign, I'd be lost without you sign. And then I came down here and I pulled out this Easter egg and put it in front of my flea market sign. I just did a little moving of the milk glass and brought out some greenery. My little squirrel will never go away candle there's an s for our last name and then this bunny grapevine um i found him at odd lots like two or three years ago on clearance and i went ahead and bought him he is so cute and he's just standing there by the fireplace and then i have the dollar tree um tin um like planter basket i have some boxwood in it but if you pan all the way out I have my grateful, thankful, blessed sign over there in the corner. And then, of course, the whole, let's see, I'm trying to back up, the whole fireplace with everything on it. And then over here is the cedar chest. Here's what I did with it. Um, there's a picture of me and David that always stays up. I put a little greenery out beside of it and a little chicky, and then this little milk glass bowl with some eggs and straw in it, and then of course my clock, and then some more eggs and straw in a milk glass bowl, a couple of books, and a book, or a sign that says happy Easter, happy spring, happy everything. Love it, need spring. And then <laughs> here's a little bunny. And then over here, I didn't really change much with my um, um, blanket ladder, I just, put my doilies on it and I got my S sign out or my S um, pillow bag and put my pillow in that. And then even the kill going into the kitchen, all my milk glass up here has pretty much stayed the same. I took a lot down and when I did, I washed and I put things back and I try to put them back where they normally don't go. So that's why you see some odd pieces in the kitchen. And then the only thing really Easter that I have in the kitchen is over here. I have my little antique chair with a um, galvanized pan and some eggs in it. That's the only real thing that is different in the kitchen. So I just wanted to touch base and update you on the spring decor. This will stay up for a couple of months and then I'll get down the good stuff. <laughs> oh, on top of the fridge is all the extra milk glass I have. I have it all rearranged differently as well. I am selling my Hoosier cabinet. So I decided not to redo it. It's just too much work. I found a different cabinet I like better. Um, and I won't worry about hurting it if it gets hit. So here is the pan again of the spring decorations for 2018. I hope everyone is enjoying their day and I will talk to you in my next one. Bye-bye.